Hey, what's up YouTube? Christy Anderson here with One Fish, Two Fish. Today I'm going to show you guys how to hook up a live crab with ease uh, because I know all my female anglers are out there too. So I'm going to show you guys uh, just a couple quick steps on how to rig this thing up uh, for some bull drum, puppy drum. These are drum candies. All right, you guys, step one, you guys want to break off these pinchers uh, just because I represent all my lady anglers out there. Some of y'all, uh, whether you're new to fishing or if you just don't know how to do this. Um, I always bring a pair of scissors with me. It makes it a little bit easier, uh, but you can also rip these guys off. All right. Okay, so now that the pinchers are off, you guys are clear and free. Um, and then he's just got all these legs that I usually kind of rip off too. All right, perfect. Okay, so that was step one. Uh, now it's time to rig him up. So what y'all are gonna do, you're gonna flip him over. I'm gonna show you guys how to hook on this crab, this blue crab right here, depending what size uh, bull drum or red drum that you guys are going after. First, uh, I'll start with, if you guys are trying to target the biggest bull drum, uh, those bull drum go after this whole crab with the shell on. So what you guys are gonna first look for are these leg holes underneath. You're gonna take your seven or eight dot circle hook and you're gonna take probably one of these back crab legs and you're gonna hook it right through here. And you want it to come out through the body. Okay, perfect. And right there, you've got your blue crab hooked up, rigged up, ready to get you guys some action for those bull drum. All right, your next option is to cut this guy in half. Uh, you can still target those bull drum, but if you guys are looking to get on smaller drum, slotted drum, or puppy drum, uh, it's gonna look like this. It just kind of presents it uh, a little bit smaller, and you guys can probably get some more hookups with that and some different size fish, which will be pretty nice. So first of all, you guys really wanna take this and the shell does come off. You just have to kind of like work with it. All right, so usually when you flip up the wing, usually the wing and the whole body comes off at once. Unfortunately, the wings came off and now you still have the middle of the body. So if you guys have scissors or anything that's a little bit more firm, you can kind of work off the shell. That shell should usually come off pretty clean. Uh, sometimes it doesn't and then you just kind of got to play with it until it does. All right, there we go. That is what you guys want. It's all that meat in there. And then you're just gonna take your scissors and you're gonna cut it in half. Whoop. Okay, perfect. All right, and then once you've got that whole shell off, you're gonna be looking for the legs where those were the last time that we hooked it because those are gonna be uh, perfect for hooking it through. Okay, so once you guys have your half of your blue crab right here, you've taken off the whole shell, you're gonna take that hook, your seven or eight dot circle hook right here, you're gonna look for those crab legs, those holes, and you're gonna just pop it right through and out through the body, just like that. Perfect, y'all, this is bull drum candy, red drum candy, it doesn't matter what size, they freaking uh, love this stuff, it's irresistible. Uh, that's how you rig it up, and this is going to be perfect for that spring uh, drum run. So you guys get ready, hit up your piers, your beaches, get your live crabs from your local tackle shop, and get out there because y'all are going to be uh, sticking the fish of a lifetime.